Hi guys, welcome to the Get East Tech YouTube channel. We keep doing the, those examples by using PSPICE, and this is the ninth additional circuit example. And the title is Peak Detector Circuit. Okay, let's get started. I already opened the uh, software program, and there is a blank circuit, and we are gonna draw our circuit. Okay, let's draw our circuit. Click P button to add your components, and first of all, add a sinusoidal voltage by typing V sin. Okay, put your sinusoidal voltage to the left side and, and again click P button to add the another component and we need a diode D1N uh, 4148 4148 this is the component that we use for this uh, circuit put your diode this place and click P button again and now we need a capacitor click C and to rotate your capacitor click R button and put your capacitor like this Okay, click again. Uh, we now need uh, a resistor. Okay, click R button and rotate it. Put your resistor here. Okay, let's let's make it closer and let's wire them. To wire them, to connect them, um, click W button from the keyboard, and you see the wire operation. Wire command is coming after that. Okay, I am connecting the circuit now. Okay. Okay, escape. Now it's finished. No, it's not finished. Don't don't forget the ground. Always, this is the important thing. Don't forget the ground value. Okay, click Y W again and wire the ground here in the circuit. Okay, the circuit uh, drawing is ready and let's give the values. Okay, let's start from the left to the right. We offset voltage is gonna be zero volt and amplitude of the sinusoidal voltage is going to be five sorry fifteen volt. And frequency is 60 hertz. 60 hertz. Okay. Okay, click enter. And now, um, there is no value for diet, and the capacitor value is going to be 520, 520 microfarads. Enter. And the resistor value is going to be 500, 500 ohm. Okay. Yes, the circuit is ready, but I want to add the node names to my circuit. To add a node name, click N button from the keyboard, and the operation is coming. Okay, click enter, input for in, and click N button again, out. Sorry, click OK, out. This is out node, input and output. Um, it makes us uh, re really easy to gr uh, to show some graphs in the uh, probe window, and you don't uh, you don't have to look at the uh, R V R one and we see one and we will we will see just v out and v in it's it helps us so much okay now um actually this this is the this the circuit is a rectifier circuit we call it as a peak detector circuit because it rectifies the sinusoidal input voltage by the uh, by its uh, peak value it takes the peak value and the the, the the output voltage will be rectified this is the specification of this circuit okay I think uh, everything is ready. Let's create the new simulation profile and um, rectifier for name recti rectify. I I will I will put rectify and create it. The simulation settings are coming now. Okay, simulation manager product product choices a P spice A and D should be P spice A and D. Okay, it's going to be time domain transient analysis. And run to time for this simulation, uh, 100 milliseconds. And this maximum step size, um, I will make it 0 0.001. That's really enough to show uh, a quality graph. Okay, click apply and click OK. And now our ev everything is ready. And let's run the simulation by clicking F11 or this button. The graph is going to come without anything, but we will add some markers or we will add traces to show some graphs as you see there is nothing it's coming now okay take it uh, under i will put a voltage marker at the output sides this is a voltage marker yes select it and put your voltage marker at the out node yes let's see what's going on there okay as you see this is the input voltage input voltage is coming to the 15 approximately 15 volt and after that Thanks to a diet and a capacitor, uh, we rectify the diodes, and this is uh, there is a small difference between uh, maximum and the minimum 
points this point and this point and we call it a ripple factor this is a ripple factor and this is uh, approximately 1.1 volt something like that uh, a ripple voltage in the electronics there, there are some different uh, voltage names and I'm not gonna give uh, too many technical informations for this video if you are interested you can uh, look at you can google it what is directed but what is ripple voltage okay um, that's all for today um, uh, the, in the next video uh, we will pass another additional circuit example and thank you very much if you like this video don't forget to share and like with your friends um, see you in the next tutorial bye bye